such a difficult transition because all my classmates were doing the same thing. So we were all English kids that were doing the French immersion program. So we had really encouraging professors who were oftentimes Acadians themselves, but they were really, um, really looking to encourage us in any way possible. Um, so I remember the classroom experience being a really positive one. It didn't feel, I, I don't think I ever felt genuinely discouraged. It was a really good way to learn. I did the French immersion high school and so my science classes were in French and of course you take your French courses and um, and then after I graduated high school I did one year at uh, the Université de Moncton. I knew that I wanted to apply to med school and I knew it's very obvious as an English person the English options available so Dalhousie is a really popular one Memorial but I knew some friends had, that had come here from my earlier years at University of Moncton and they talked really well of the program and I said, you know, what greater way to continue in French than to push yourself even more and try and do it in French. Everyone here is really encouraging and if I'm saying something wrong or maybe there's a more delicate way to say something, people are really kind at giving me help or, you know, giving me the phrase that might work better in that situation. So again, another really great encouraging environment to learn in. Um, so anyone that I, is thinking about trying the immersion program, I would say, you know, give it a try and, and, and why not give it a go? It's definitely an investment for the future. I'm Megan Blackyear. I'm going into second year med school at the University of Sherbrooke in Moncton. And I did the late immersion program in Moncton, New Brunswick.